Hello and welcome to this video tutorial to set class path for Apache Tomcat server in Windows 7. I assume that Apache Tomcat server is already installed on your system. Setting class path for servlet API is important for Java server programs or servlets to run. Servlet API is provided by the Apache Tomcat server as a servlet-api.jar file. I am going to take an example of a servlet program. In this program, as you can see, we have servlet packages imported. I am going to compile this program. After compiling, this shows errors saying Java X servlet HTTP package does not exist. This is because of the reason that class path for the servlet package is not set. To set the class path, you can select computer from the desktop, right click, select properties and click advanced system settings on the top left corner of the window. System property dialog box pops up with the advanced tab selected. Click environment variables button. In the environment variables you have two options. You can set user variables or you can set system variables. It is better to set class path and system variables. You may or may not have class path variable inside the systems variable tab. If you already have a class path variable then you can click edit or else you need to create a new class path variable by clicking new. Now select the class path and click edit. The class path will be under variable name. Next you need to provide the physical part to the servlets hyphen API dot jar file under variables values. You can type the complete, complete path but it's better to browse to the location and copy the, copy the path. The servlets-api.jar file is located in the lib folder where the Apache Tomcat server is installed. I have installed the Apache Tomcat server in D drive under program files. The servlet-api.jar file is present inside program files Apache Software Foundation, Tomcat, and lib directory. In some cases, depending upon the version of Apache Tomcat server, lib directory itself may be present in the commons folder. I am going to copy the entire path from the address bar and append it at the end or at the beginning of the class path. Now I am going to append it at the beginning of the class path. After pasting path till the lib type backslash followed by serve let hyphen api dot jar which is the file name for the servlets api and then followed by a semicolon to delimit the other path. You can click now the OK button, but before that, make sure that at the end of the path, you have a semicolon and dot. Close it by clicking OK, close the environment variables and click OK to close the system properties. Close all the command terminals in case they are open. Now we can open the command prompt where the servlet file a servlet program is present and compile the program using Java C. As you can see there are no errors of Java X servlet package does not exist. In case if you get the same error then you need to recheck your path to servlet hyphen API jar file. Thanks for taking time to watch this video.